Excuse my language. I am gassed. I am gassed. I am gassed, right, people? Uh, 114 of you. I'm not on my own. We've got the boys. We've got Ramondo. Yeah. We've got Coxie. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And we've got fucking Army Bolton. Sink it in. Sink it in. Oh, Griff, 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 Griff. 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 The takeover is being done in the next coming days. Oh, I'm done. Yes, I'm done. Sky Sports is concerned. Come on. Let's Come go! On. Come on. And Come on. breaking news, breaking news, okay? It's not just us four, okay? We have got, can I get a drum roll? Can I get a drum roll? <laughs> He's not here yet. He's not here. Turn your bloody camera on, Smithy. Turn on. <laughs> right, boys, before we get Smithy in, um, I want everyone in the comments to comment down below one word how you're feeling right now, okay? There's 133 of you in here. I'm shocked. I didn't expect it to be tonight. It's come so quick. It's come really, really quickly. And um, it's brilliant, brilliant news. <sighs> I can't believe it, boys. I can't believe Let's it. Let's fucking have it, mate. We're going up. <laughs> <laughs> We're going up. We're going up. We're going up. That's um, not quite. That's not really the news I was sort of expecting to see tonight. But you know what? It, I, yeah, I'm loving every minute of it. <laughs> What's going on? What is going on? Ooh. Right, um, right, drum roll, let's go. Go on in, go on in. Oh, oh. oh. let's go, <laughs> Come on, he's Double. gone. I can't believe it. He's I'm gone. so sad that Lambert's left, boys. I'm sad. All oh, right, get out. I can't believe it. <laughs> right. Um, boys, obviously we're all happy, but I don't know what to say. What do you make of this? They two, let's oh. get on the bed, boys. Come on. Do you know what's weird, right? This is for, for, for Paul Lambert going. <laughs> oh, <my laughs> hey. Do you know what's mad, right? I'm going to put myself up here in the middle. Uh, me and Coxie were on headset. My phone popped off. I was like, I read it. I was like, what the fuck? Like, Mate. I can't, I'm, I'm shocked. I, Mate, I that was we're fucking time. loaded. We're fucking loaded. <laughs> <laughs> right, 140 people in there. Everyone smash that thumbs up button. If you are happy, Lambert's gone. I think, I don't know if we can say, Harvey, about who's coming in. We probably can, can't we? Cause it's Maybe. Happen, isn't we'll, it? we've got, yeah. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> Um, right, boys, I don't know what to talk about. I'm, I'm genuinely shocked. Like, it's just, it's fresh news, isn't it? It's fresh news. Yeah. Um, do you think, Ooh. do you think, obviously it was the right decision. Um, do you, do you think it was a bit, do you think, do you feel, do any of you feel sorry for Lambert or not? No. Nothing else. Nope. <laughs> mate, he can get, like, <laughs> he, he can go, he can go to the dog mate. He's gone, I don't care. Nah. Yeah. I mean, you know, you know why the team started winning games, don't you? It's because these yeah. these owners are now turning up, aren't they? You know, it's all yeah. it's all put in place. You see that comment, boys. Marcus Bisco, Jack Jackson liked the post about Lambert left his loving life. Really? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> oh my word! You see, that's um, another thing. It's it's having these players back in that you know them that starting eleven and also the uh, the substitutions as well because these there's two of them players have been demoted to the under twenty threes, and one scored four goals already this season. So tell me what's yeah. wrong about all this management, eh? hundred percent. Got to get them all together I, I, if we can have that push up the league, eh? To, that's what we need. USA, 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 USA. Um, look, I actually think we're going up, boys. Come on, HMS piss the league's back on. Yeah, Jackson <laughs> actually liked it, <laughs> mate. Done. You know what's weird? It's just I just I'm just shocked it's happened tonight because it's Sunday night. You wouldn't have thought they'd have put it up tonight. Look, uh, that's look what, at, that's... Look at uh, Grace's comment. Oh, oh gosh, right. Everyone Scroll in the comments, right. comment. Get, get, get your comments in. Get your comments in. We're going to get some comments up on the screen. Who um, said that I saw Paul Cook, Paul Cook outside the training ground? She did say that, that to be fair. I'll tell you what. I, I, was that, that. I, was thinking about, I was thinking about that today when Grace told you that, Coxie. And, I, you know, it's, it must it must have been must have been him. Uh, we've got Tobotic in here. Has <laughs> the takeover actually been done yet? Coxie, do you want to... And ask... Grant Ward. I'm done. What? Do to... Grant, Grant Ward liked as well. Ah! Grant Ward? <laughs> Yeah, that's what? amazing. I'm that done. is amazing. Um, look, <laughs> I want to know, Coxie. You uh, you said you said a minute ago, takeover could happen in the next few days. Sky Sports Let just reported know. that. Yeah. Really? Cool. Yeah. Oh Bro, my if, word! If if the takeover weren't happening, he wouldn't have been sacked. Yet. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Simple as that. A hundred percent. Um. Uh. You look. Okay. Look. We got we got Norwich fans in it. Norwich fans. Your most successful manager is dog. Fuck off, you pants. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Norwich fans, come on, then. Let's have it. Who's got banner? Let's have it. I'm in the mood for banner. I'm in the mood for banner. Your most successful manager is dog. So crap. Um, right, anyway. Yeah, he didn't get sacked. It was mutual. But uh, it, it's, it's, oh, well. it's good. Nah, it was, it was an gone. agreement. He would have been paid that two million. He'd have had yeah. to been paid the two million. Yeah. 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 Exactly. Um, anyway, what I think I might do, boys, is I might put the link in the chat and get some people. Get all the banners in. Let's go. Because I, I, I think a lot of people will want to come on here and have something to say. Of course they will. Um, so let, let's get the link in the chat. Um, do subscribe. Get your to the beers ready. <laughs> get, get the beers, beers out. Get, get, get the beers out. Come get on. Get your beers out. Um, but look, right. The link is going in the chat. There's 176 of you in here. Smash the link. Get involved. Give us your opinions. If you if you're not an Ipswich fan, still come on. Ask us any questions if you want. We, this stream was very last minute, weren't it, boys? We weren't expecting. Oh yeah. Tonight. Yeah, um, it was. 100%. So if anyone has any questions, come in. Get involved. Get them in the comments. We've got nearly 200 people in here. Which is uh, quite mental. Um, and yeah, after this stream tonight, I'm going to actually put up a video as boys, well. Boys, Tony Mowbray has just left Blackburn. Has he? As well. Nah, nah he's not coming. He won't be coming there. We nah. know who's coming. It's Paul Cook. Hayley yeah. Smith is here. Hayley! Yeah! <laughs> Harvey. We have, we have. And we're out and we winning. Yay! <laughs> no, man, man. Guys, guys, it's brilliant news. Absolutely brilliant. Well, look, Alex, yeah. I literally saw it with you putting it up and I jumped into Chaz's room. Me and Chaz just went mental. Yeah. I can't, I, I'm still saw... in shock. I can't believe yeah, we've done it tonight. No, it's strange to do it on a Sunday though, isn't it? Yeah, yeah Sunday night, eh? Monday can be mm, Sunday night. Yeah, because yeah. Alex, me and my mum obviously subscribed to you. It just come up with a notification on our phones saying mm. Paul Lambert's being sat. I was like, what? Yes, get in yeah. there. We thought yeah. we thought you was winding us up. Yeah. <laughs> no, I was not winding you up. Griffin, <laughs> I feel like I'm, feel like I'm dreaming hey, right now. If I had cool. a pyro, I'd take one off right now. But <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, but we can, we can all have a drink now, can't we? Because we're on the up, we guys. Can. We're on the up definitely what are you on? now. What are you, drink what are you drinking, Hayley? 
Uh, Carlsberg. I'm on the white Carlsberg. wine. Who's on the dark fruits? Yeah. Anyone on the dark fruits? <laughs> Who's on the JD? Oh, dark fruits. Look, look, Who's on the JD? Yeah, that's nice. My, my drink samples. Yeah, nice I'll have to get a new selection in after. It's a special after. occasion. I'm opening a dark fruits. <laughs> Come on. Go, Alex. Go, Alex. I'm back. Go, Alex. He's gone. <laughs> Come so, a little bit longer. Hold on. Hang on, Chaz has gone to get something. So, what, what do you guys think about it? Amazing. Brilliant. Good this is it? just what we wanted to see before Monday, finally, eh? <laughs> finally, that's what we've want, yes, we wanted. It's what we've wanted for all these months who, now. Who do you and reckon is going to take over? Do you reckon Cook will take over? Yeah, yeah I reckon we Cook. They could yeah. yeah. Didn't they see that Cook was in the manager's room or something? I swear. Guys, when when we can all go back, we'd all have to meet up and cheer. We'd all have to take a drink mm. up Portman Road. <laughs> yeah. Who are me? Come on. Who are me? There we go. Right. <laughs> Hayley, Chaz up. We're going to yes, get sorry. lots more people in. Thanks for coming on. All right, sweetie. All right, guys. Um, love you all. Love you all. See relax. you Tuesday. Relax. Relax. Oh. Legends. Bye, guys. Bye. All right. Legends for coming on. Anyone else that wants to come on, please click the link. Oh, oh, cook, oh, oh, he's ready, mate. He's ready. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> right. We're going to get in another person. Liam. 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 Hello. Right. First of all, what I would like to say, as a Norwich fan, I come in peace. Okay? Oh, so don't give okay. me... Um, Liam, Liam. <laughs> I'm, a look, look, I'm, look, Liam. A I'm a Norwich boy. But what I'm trying right. to say, Go thank on. God you got rid of Agent Lambert, right? Okay, first <laughs> off, right? Okay, so you know what? I I miss the days of our derby days. It's now yeah. been God knows how many years since we actually played you, right? Norwich, we beat Wickham today 2 0. You guys had a good result, um, but Agent Lambert, thank God you got rid of him. The guy has been in a complete, absolute shit show wherever yeah. he's gone, okay. Um, all I'm trying yeah. to say is that it's, it's right. As a Norwich fan, I wish you all the very best. I hope that you all actually get into the playoffs. Honestly, I do. You got Oxford above you. Um, you're not going. You're not far off. You're not far off. But we're going up to the Premiership this year. We are. Yeah, and then, how many yeah. times? There, there, there must be at least what thirteen years. People are born in like thirteen years. Or, I haven't actually seen you guys beat us, mm. but I miss our rivalry. Yeah. I do miss the dark days, and I do wish mm. you well. I do wish yeah. you well. But don't forget, yeah. like, when it when it when it dropped that um, Paul Lambert has been sacked, I was just like, "Oh, it took you a while, but it must have cost mm. a few million from Marcus Evans." Yeah. Yeah. Two, two, surely million. Two, million. two million, wasn't it? Two million yeah. quid. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my Literally. god, is he going out with two million? Oh, yeah. Right. He, he is. yeah. You know, I don't, I don't, I don't hold anything against you as a canary. I don't have, you know, you call us budgies, we call you binners, whatever. But, you know, it, we don't have any rivalries. Your rivalry right now is Peterborough and Northampton. <laughs> Come on. We need to yeah. actually compete. To, you got, guys mm. have won the UEFA. If you guys have, have been champions of bloody Europe, for goodness sakes. All that Norwich has done. And I am a canary. I'm a lifelong canary. What have we done? We won the Milk Cup in 1985. But I'm not going to say that about... We are a yo-yo up there. We've got great players in the sense of Buendia, Krull, um, Puki, Ash, uh, Aarons, uh, Cantwell. You guys, right? What the hell is going on down there? You guys should be up there. You guys should be up there. We should, and I we will be. I feel as, I we feel as if we get takeover as well, and um, we get money spent. I feel as if we're going to come for Norwich. <laughs> we'll get our revenge. <laughs> but you don't have to bloody own your own ground. Apparently, Suffolk County Council own bloody Portman Road. What the hell? Mm. Yeah. Mm. It's been mismanaged. Think... It's been mismanaged from the start down there. It's been mismanaged yeah. from the start. Yeah. yeah. Liam, I respect you coming on because a lot of Norwich fans wouldn't have the balls to come on. I want to know. No, I have got the balls to come on. Because I come when, in peace. Yeah. When Respectful. Paul Lambert was at Norwich, do you believe it was Lambert that that did it for you or was it the the team you had? No, when Lambert took us over, we got Dick 7-0 by Colchester and we went down to League One. And we bounced back straight from League One into the Championship and straight back into the Premiership. 
Mm. Lambert actually took us up there, right? So yeah. we did, we did, we did well. But you know, with the parachute payments and everything, we invest though in our academy and we invest in our youth. Um, look at Todd Cantwell, for example. He's from Durham in Norfolk. My God, what a player he is! Been touted for bloody Barcelona, for goodness' sakes, right? So it is, it is what it is. But I'm telling you, down there. Right, even oh, I, I have to say this right today. <laughs> we played Wickham 2 0 and we stuck two past Stockwell, who I believe actually played for you <laughs> 18 times. Fact. Stop there, yeah. yeah. Yeah, he did. Back, yeah, well, well back. he went, he went yeah. too bad, yeah. to be fair. Yeah. We've had worse keepers. <laughs> One thing is, as a Norwich fan, as a Norwich fan, I'm sure I can speak for a lot of fans um, of Norwich, and I'm, I'm I'm trying to say this in a the most uh, diplomatic way, right? We don't hate you, right? We love to beat you, <laughs> right? Because it's a derby. But I want our East Anglian farm derbies coming back. So all I'm saying to you is. You're you're a, you're a love. I, I follow you, Alex. I I follow your your streams or whatever. I see you going up and down and whatever, whatever, whatever. I hope, I hope, I really do hope, honestly, truthfully, as an Orange fan, I hope you get back up into the championship, and I hope you. St- start pushing for promotion. I really do want Norwich Ipswich back on the cards. Because the last time I watched Norwich <laughs> Ipswich, <laughs> we equalised <laughs> on oh, the last no, minute of don't. the game. <laughs> I don't think that would I don't think I don't think that would have happened if Peter Kelsey come out of goal to be fair. Yeah. Mm. I think he gifted yeah. Norwich so that goal. Go. Oh yeah you did Liam. gift <laughs> Liam, before we get another person in, I want to know where do you think Ipswich will finish now? I think Ipswich are gonna I think personally, in my opinion, if you carry on doing what right, okay, you messed it up against Oxford. Um, but I think you will be in the playoffs and you'll be you'll be there or thereabouts in the playoffs. Oh. Okay. I think yeah, well, personally. I think- and I and I wish and I wish you all the best. But honestly, honestly, I wish you all the best. Yeah, thank you very anyway. much. Anyway, yeah. respect to you, mate. Thanks for coming respect on. Me. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. Love you lots. <laughs> bye bye. In a bit, bro. There we go. Um, that was Liam, Norwich fan. Okay. Uh, right. Two hundred and six people in here. Smash that thumbs up button if you are glad Lambert's gone. Please oh, press the red. Hey. Please oh, press that red hey. subscribe button. We're gonna get the next person in. Harry. Okay, I'm gonna be quick because I need to finish champs. I was a good old lad. But life is worth living. Jesus is clearly real. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Well, where's this coming from? He certainly is. He certainly is. It, yeah, I know. It's it, amazing, it, isn't it? This is mad. I can't uh, believe it. If I could, I'd get drunk. I could. I'd get fully on drunk to be honest. Well, honestly, this is mad. If I don't wake yeah, up tomorrow and see, and see, or the next couple of days and see that we've had takeover, I'll be bit annoyed. Oh, boys, can you imagine when we're back at Portland Road, start singing Paul Cook's Barmy Army, Army OTFC? Oh. <laughs> so, Harry, did you did you see this coming as soon as it was going to come out, or did you think it would no. be like a couple of weeks, maybe I thought, the the, the, I thought the takeover would come the same time as the second. No, no chance. Yeah. yeah. But takeover takes a lot longer. Yeah. Sorry, right, boys. Matt Gillis still at Ipswich. Huh? Matt Gillis still at Ipswich. So, so Ipswich. what does that mean then? He'll be in charge on Tuesday night. Oh, yeah. Accrington. Yeah. Do you reckon we'll get anything against them then? Three points, mate. No, that Lambert's not here. They're going up, boys. I <laughs> <laughs> hope so. Hey, <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah. Can't believe it. Um. Anyway, Harry. I think on this special occasion, you should give us your favourite Ipswich chant, mate. Come on, let's hear it. Go on. Paul Cook is a blue, is a blue. <laughs> I'm just like, I, I'm just speechless, to be honest. Go Come on, we want a chant, mate. Right. True Ipswich chant. Oh, uh, um, every Saturday we follow. Oh, we cheer the boys in blue. Champions of England. England. 
In 1962, Bobby Sean in Europe, and we won the FA Cup. We support the Ipswich, and we fucking blow it up! Champagne out! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh Lord! Oh my God! Love that! Right, that's what we want to hear. It's amazing. Boy, our new stadium is going to be called the Chicago, Chicago Stadium. Boys, boys, <laughs> boys! Sky Sports should put a statement out. If Paul Lambert has left the job at Ipswich Town Manager after differences of opinion with owner. Yeah, he said he left on mutual consent. So does that mean yeah. he got paid? Oh, he looks too tired yeah. for the chance. <laughs> he, mate, he. What? He if he's left paid, without getting paid, paid, fair dues. No, he wouldn't. No, he wouldn't. He, he wouldn't. No, uh, no. Nah. I reckon he's probably sat behind that, which you're not telling us. So, and yeah. that is the uh, odds list, if you guys can see. I don't know if you can. Boys, no, no. just read. I'm going to go because otherwise, I'm going to not get any weekend league, but get someone else on. Oh, yeah. Enjoy. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Um, cool. I'm going to put the StreamYard link in the comments if anyone else wants to join. Click the link. We're going to get another person in in a minute. There's 202 people in it. After this live stream, I'm going to edit a little video because I did film a video straight as I heard it. Um, and that'll go up in a uh, after this stream. Right. Uh, we're going to get in. Lewis, how are you doing? I can't believe it. <laughs> yeah. Give me that just minutes. came out of nowhere. He's a man, God boy. Come on. <laughs> oh, how did it take him so long, though? I don't know. No, I didn't. But you know what? I mean, how do you feel? Are you speechless? Yep. Yeah. It's amazing, right, I just want to answer a question. Another Norwich fan's put in here. The weird thing is, why do you sack someone after consecutive wins but not sack him when you lose? And the, the reason is, I think the players knew he was probably going, which is why yeah. they started winning. And do you reckon Harvey, anything do you to up... what he said yesterday after the um, game? Do you reckon yeah. he had to do with anything yeah. he said yesterday? 100%. 100%. Yeah. yeah, yeah Harvey, yeah, do you want right. to bring up that... That tweet you saw earlier that you sent to me, because that was a very good point you you, you told me about. Um, yeah, where, where did I send that to? That was on Twitter in our little group. Um, do you want to read, you read it out, Alice, it's in, it's in mine and your yeah. match chat? I mean, to be honest, this is for the best, probably, isn't it, really? It's probably... it is. yeah. Coxie, what are the um, manager odds? Just have a read of the top three, which are... The manager odds? Yeah, go on. Um, hang on, two seconds. Have you got them? Have you, right. Are they out, are they? Is, They're is, out is, now, right. Okay, yeah. Paul Cook is one to three. Oh, wow. Danny yeah. Cowley, six to one. If Danny Kieran Cowley Dyer, comes in, I'm not going to another Ipswich game. Kieran <coughs> Dyer, eight to one. Hmm? Neil Harris, ten to one. Ryan Lowe, 14 oh, to one. That's the Plymouth manager, isn't it? Ryan Lowe. Yeah. Nigel Ankins, 16 to one. Gary <laughs> Monk, 20 to one. Michael Flynn, 20 to one. Um, Chris Coleman, twenty-five to one. Chris Coleman, and they've even had the cheek to put Mick McCarthy on there, twenty-five to one. <laughs> <laughs> he's not going anywhere, oh mate. He's, he's one to three. Paul Cook's coming in. Yeah, yeah, sure. that's all been um, done. I think. Anyway, I'm, I've got a tweet here. I'm going to read it out. Okay, mm. Lewis, you can give us your thoughts on it as well. But um, tweet from Dave Strang on Twitter. He put. This takeover at ITFC has proved what, I'm not going to read them out, what self-serving group of players we've got at the club couldn't care less about the club or the fans all season and they're now pulling their fingers out to save their asses when the new owners arrive. What do you make of that tweet? Um, Anyone? Spot Sorry. on. Yeah. Mm. How has it taken this long? You know, I wanted him out in December uh, 2019. <laughs> Yeah, you know what I mean, I, I think he should have gone in March. To be honest with you, yeah, 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 exactly, yeah. Coxie. Yeah, it saved his job. You know, any manager would have been gone by that point. You know, I know we won two games. I know we've been on like what? I think we've been unbeaten in like five out of six in, of our last games. You know, that's like I say, it's good to see it happening at the moment. But we need change. We've been due yeah. change for so long now, boys. You know, it's we need a new, we need a new ambition. We need new everything. And I think it starts with the manager. Yeah. Then we go yeah. next from there on. Paul so. Cook would definitely be the yeah. right man. Paul Cook, yeah. for sure. Yeah, definitely. If it wasn't, if it, I think number two for me would be probably Neil Harris for me, personally. Neil Harris? Yeah. No? Yeah. I, think I mean, he has taken Neil up before, to be fair, mate. So, you have got a valid point. I, yeah, and I think... And to be fair with Cardiff, in his first season, he got them playoffs, to be fair, when they were in, what, mid-table? No, you know, you're right. Yeah, he did, didn't he? Yeah. 
He did. Yeah. I think. Yeah, but yeah, definitely Paul Cook. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Well. Did you guys? Um, were you a bit annoyed maybe with Pearson that he went to Bristol City, or were you like, all right, let's just get Paul Cook in now? I mean, I, I think yeah, it would have been nice to just go for Werner at the time. But, if we're being realistic, we weren't going to get him, were we? <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure really if he'd been the right. Um, Manager, really. I don't think he's I got think the right. He I think he would have, you know, been quite firm with them all. I think that's what we would have probably have needed if we weren't winning games at all. But I think now we're, if we're going to be getting Paul Cook, he will get us playing better football. He will get I the team the same, more yeah. morale. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's what we want to see. Yeah. Result. Yeah, the same mentality as well, I reckon. Yeah. yeah. Um. Right, Lewis. Thanks for coming on, mate. Yeah. Cheers, cheers mate. mate. Before you go. Before you go, I want to hear your favourite Charlie. Ah, <laughs> let's hear it. Man. I knew Come this on. was coming. <laughs> I had to ask. Come on. Uh, all right. Blue Army. Blue Army. Legend, man. Thanks for coming on. Cheers, guys. See you in a bit, mate. All right. Um. Okay. What was I going to say? What was I going to say? We've got a few more people waiting. We'll get them in in a sec. There's a few <laughs> comments I want to get up. Okay. Um. There was, oh, I've, I've, I've lost it now. I've lost it. We'll come back to it. Um, right, we're going to get in. We'll get in this fella first. Come on, Oliver. Hello, Alex. Um, Hello, how are you doing? All right. Oh. Oliver, how are you feeling? Buzz, seriously. Like, I was just on, just watching some YouTube on the TV, getting up close on Twitter, and I'm like... What? Crazy. Amazing, isn't it? Sorry. So, um, what do you make of what do you make of all this happening so quickly? Then, would you who do you like as your manager, Paul Cook, or any other per yeah, one of the other person who meets Paul. the requirement? Yeah, Paul Cook, yeah? yeah, yeah, yeah. So, what do you think then? Um, in terms of going to Appleton, do you think he'll be here by that point, or do you think it'll just be Matt Gill still for the moment? They could, they could be an appointment very shortly. You never know. It could be all done tomorrow for we yeah, know. Was, you know? When all this takeover talk was going on, it was like, that was a bit of a shock. And now yeah. this, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just a crazy, uh, crazy times. Mm. It's all happened very mm. quickly as well. So, yeah. yeah. See what happens, don't we? Yeah. yeah 100%. Hopefully, this is the first step of the club moving to the right direction. Yeah. Is it playoffs, yeah. Oliver? Um, hopefully, like, yeah. some promotion, but... We're winning the title. I'm done. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to I'll be bottom, I'll so tell you what, I'll, tell you, yeah. what, I'll tell you a little stat. Screenshot, sir. Speaking to you. Um, two years... No, four years ago, 2017, Paul Cook was in charge at Portsmouth in League Two. Pompey were... At this stage in the season, they were seventh in the league. Paul Cook came in, won them the league in League Two. So, yeah. don't write it off. That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, no, yeah. I know. Yeah. Like, I, know I think I know. if Wigan hadn't gone into administration, I think he still would have been there. Yeah, no, 100% he would have been there. He he yeah. was he, he got him 13th in the league. I mean, that's yeah. just quite remarkable if you ask me. Yeah. yeah. So I think he'll be the right man for our club. But yeah, yeah. hopefully we'll be soaring and flying into the championship soon. Yeah, Obviously, but then we said about Paul Hurst and Paul Lambert, didn't we? And look, yeah, it's yeah. the third Paul now, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Third chance. Well, yeah, hope, do you think Paul Cook will get announced this week? Could be um, too hard, it? Yeah. Be. Well, they're saying he's going to be managing by next week. I think he'll be announced once the takeover is done. Yeah. Really? 100%. <laughs> You'd have well, thought hopefully it would be, be as early as that. So I can't guessed. believe it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. Anyway, Oliver, before I get you out, you know what's coming, don't you? <laughs> Let's hear it, mate. Come on. I can't because my brother's asleep next door. Oh. Fair enough. Just say like Blue Army. Just say Blue, Blue Army. Army. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> Got out of it in the end. Blue Army. Mm. Right, Oliver, thanks for coming on, mate. All right. Enjoy your evening. Yeah. It's such yeah. crazy, man. I saw it on Sky Sports or someone said it. I'm not sure. Oh, yes. One, one to five now, Paul Cook. It's gone from one to three to one to five. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Right, we're going to get in another person in a sec. But Should, please... I, stick a... Should I stick a one on it? Stick it all you got <laughs> yeah, on it. Go on then. Uh, right, Max everyone, Post smash that thumbs up button. We're hitting 200 likes on the stream for the big news. Uh, please do press that red subscribe button as well. Um, this is our live reaction to Paul Lambert being uh, sacked, mu mutually sent off. I don't know what you want to call it. Um, sent right, off? A few... <laughs> I don't know. 
He wasn't sacked, was he? It was a, like a mutual Sent agreement, off. wasn't it? Get out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, right. Alex. Okay. We're going to get Ipswich. in. That says Ipswich. Oh, they have part of company with manager Paul Lambert. Part Lamb of company. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's probably part. the right word. Right. Jonathan is here. Oh, hey. Well, hey. Hey. You're in the show, Jonathan. You're in the show. Hello. How are we doing? Woo! Woo! Can you hear my voice in the background? Kai, you got you. You're in a dark room. You got lights in there. Speak, hey, Jonathan. I'm so sorry <laughs> cool that Lambert's been sacked. There we go. Are we? Main man. Are we? We're developing photos. Developing photos. Oh yeah. You got so how do you, so who you want as manager then, boys? You want Paul Cook <laughs> or who else? What, what have you got to say? So who you want as manager then, boys? You want Paul Cook or who else? I'd, I'd have Paul Cook. You have Paul Get Cook. Get in. Get I'm, in. I'm, I'm done. So um, where do you think we'll finish the season now when we get Paul Cook then? It's, there's a bit of a lag. It's delayed, this thing. It's, it's delayed, is it? Yeah. There's a bit of a lag. Yeah. I can hear our own stream in the background. Mm. I can, literally. Um, right. Jonathan, I want to know. I want to know. Give us a blue army. Go on. I've got to turn the volume down. Jonathan, I want to know. I want to know. Give us a blue army. <laughs> Come right, on, Jonathan. Thanks for coming on. <laughs> oh, my God. Right. Right. Oh, right. Right. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. <laughs> right. 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 Why would you mate, you can eat, mate. That. You can even be Arsenal, mate. You can even be Arsenal. I don't know. Give him a bit of that. Give him a bit of that. Now. Oh, Harvey's done it. It's annoying. I don't know. Oh, dear. What happened to Paul Lambert? Go away, Paul Lambert. Oi, man. Where are Tottenham in the league? Where Tottenham in the league? Where Leicester in the league? Done it. You're a legend, Johnny. You're a legend. Legend, mate. Right, Mayan. Yeah. We're gonna get another person in. Have you got anything else to say? Hey, you're um I'm happy I hope you get come up this season and shit on Norwich. I just hate Norwich. And also you all and come on you blues. Blue Army! Love Love it. It. Love it. Love it. Love it. Legend, right. We're going to get the next Alex. person in. Alex. Yeah. Is Indonesia a continent or a country? I'm done. Mm. Out you go, young man. We are not having that. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. <laughs> oh, I'm the right. question, yeah. Let's get in, Theo. Yo, right, boys. Yo, right, mate. Yeah, Theo, how you doing? Can't hear you. Uh, I can't really can't hear you, mate. Can't hear you, mate. You're oh, quiet. wait, one sec. Can you hear I'll me now? Now, I'll you now? Oh, just, oh, just, um, well, it's been a good night for me so far. Yeah. Same just for pack, us. Pack Neymar and Mbappe. <laughs> oh, really? I'm done. Unreal. That's unreal. The same one. And Love then, it, mate. Obviously, went on my phone and saw Lambert got sacked. That's mad, isn't it? Yeah. What a week. Yeah. So. What a day. Are you, are you, um, I don't know what you said before, because I think you were on the previous stream after a game before, but are you, um, for uh, Paul Cook in charge or anyone else? Yeah, Paul Cook. Paul Cook, yeah. Well, are we getting like playoffs? Now, that's, that's not really, really Are we getting game. playoffs or are we getting automatics then? Go on. No, we're winning the league. Win the <laughs> league? He, oh, loves, oh, it. Oh, he loves it. He loves it. He loves to see it. May, we may sign um, Harry Kane next year or something. I don't know. <laughs> 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 Unbelievable. Where do you reckon we're going to finish then? 
Well, um, I think they're very optimistic, aren't they? I'm going to no, say no, playoffs. No, no. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say I'm playoffs, playoffs yeah. and then we're going to win. I think playoffs, boys. I think playoffs. Win the playoffs. Well. I'm done. I'm done. What, imagine you, fans you, at Wembley. A day out at Wembley. Oh, oh Griff, imagine. Or Harvey, we're on Harvey on a beers and a sesh <laughs> at Wembley. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I can't wait if that is the case. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I'll, yeah, def I'll, I'll definitely put that day off work. <laughs> I can't so, yeah, I think, I think we're then. just all very speechless, really, mate, at the moment. We're all very speechless. Do you reckon it's we're going to spray it or get it comfortably? Say that again. Uh, say again. Can you hear me now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Playoffs. yeah. He, I think he said, do, 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 do we think we're going to scrape playoffs or get, get in there comfortably? I think we'll get there comfortably. Comfortably, fair. I think, we yeah. Aren't that, we aren't that far off, mate. No. Nah. Like third or fourth. Two point, we're two points off. I think, I think Paul Trick's coming in, and if well, I don't know, I think he'll do well with it. Switch. I think we'll get. I think we'll get third or fourth. Yeah, I, I can see. Have you, happening. have you lot heard about the Norwood situation? Yeah. What with the uh, drink driving? Yeah. What do you reckon is going to happen there? Well, he's not um, playing its fleet with apparently, is he? Yeah. I saw that on TWTD. Yeah. 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 Hmm. yeah I think he'd be quite a big miss, wasn't he? Yeah. Yeah. It's banned. Yeah. I like to say it would be a big miss, wouldn't he? But it would, that's yeah. why we need Jackson. You see, that's why we need Jackson back. I think Jack, I think, I think he'll come in Tuesday. I reckon he will. Yeah, yeah I got I a feeling he will. Do, do you like think Troy Parrott's still going to start now? Lambert's not there. Um, I think it could be, to be it could fair. be Jackson Norwood again, couldn't it? Norwood's not there. Oh no, Jackson <laughs> and Parrott then. Sorry, it won't be it won't be Sears or Drain then, will it? Drain. Oh. Dre needs to go. Dre He's no. awful. <laughs> he needs <Yeah>. to go. <laughs> yeah. I'm not being funny, but stick me up top and I'll bang more goals in him. <laughs> He's got like one goal in three yeah. years or something. And he tackled the goalie. It weren't even a goal. Yeah. yeah. Mm. But that's still yeah. one important point towards our, you know, Pistol League. Mm. You know, come on. <laughs> Always gone. Right. Um, yeah. Look, we're going to get some more people in in a second. I am going to put the link in again. I've seen Norwich fans in it. If any Norwich fans want to come on here, Please hit the link. I can see Shane in here. Shane's been on here before, hasn't he? I remember him. Um, Shane, if you want to come on the stream and have a chat, click the link. I know it's late. Um, it's quarter past ten on a Sunday. And a lot of people probably have work tomorrow. But, Lambert's gone. Um, Harvey, have you, what were you going to say earlier? Did you say something? Hang on. Hang on. Um, we're getting a call. We're getting a call. We're going we're to answer this call on the stream. Who's up? Oh, hang on. Yes, Howard. Yes, sir. Hey. I'm, I'm, I'm alright. I'm, watch, I'm watching the stream. You're live on the stream. <laughs> yes, sir. Oi, mate, feel free to come on if you want. Click the link and yeah, we'll get you in. Yeah, get yourself on, Howard. I'll, I'll, I'll have it once I've, uh, once I've down my ass. But what, what are we all drinking in? Oh, oh, mate, I'm on the Dark Fruits. Ask Howard, ask Howard how Sheffield United That's is. Dark Fruits. How, Smithy said, how's Sheffield United? <laughs> you what? How's the Sheffield United job going? Yeah, pretty good. <laughs> right, Howard, get your drink down and join the stream, all right? Oh, okay. I'll catch it a bit. All right, in a bit. Right. Heck, boys. He's drunk. <laughs> well, I'm not being funny. Connor Thompson, need, the he, man. People need, yeah, he, people need to stop the, the thingy in the chat. There's no need for hate. There's no need to hate, man. Yeah, come on. Yeah, no hate, come on. It's meant to be no a good hate. night, boys. Right. It's meant to be a good night, you know? It Come is on. a good night, and it looks like from this light lighting in this guy's room, he's having a party. Here we go. Oh, hello. <laughs> he's oh, he's quick. No lighty, no party, or no, 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 no likey, no light, or whatever it is. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> Lambert, go, go, go. I'm doing well. really good, mate. Yeah, I'll just. Uh, fan, I didn't... Aren't you? Yeah. Mm. Is it what fan? Norwich fan? No. Spurs. Spurs. Oh, Spurs uh, fan, sorry. Hey, are, Harvey. Oh, oh. Yeah, mate. Oh, 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 Spurs. Oh, what? Yeah. So, actually, what, what what do you think of Bale now, then? Do you think he's hitting form? I mean, he showed... I mean, against... If, um, when he, he came well against today. City... Yeah, when he came against City... I know mean, he lost the game 3-0, but... He, was, he, he, he showed a good spark of potential to be... Mm. To, to hit form for us. Yeah. Um, like, he, I think he's, he went through a couple of players, got shot on target, good save from Edison, but... Then he came on against West Ham, thought he had an even better game, and then, obviously, two games... I know they're know against... Euro, you know, Europa League teams, Wolfsburger, but he, he's, he's still like that goal he scored with um, in the se in the second leg. Like no, no keeper saving that. Right, that, that's been the um, Gareth Bale you've been wanting to see, though, isn't it? Really, since he's come yeah, in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then obviously, yeah, yeah um, really good game today. 
Would you take him yeah. on a permanent now? Hmm? Uh, take- if he if he puts uh, if he puts more of those performances in, I would say take him for a second year. Yeah, that's fair yeah. enough. Archie, mm. what do you make of the um, Lambert situation with Ipswich? I mean, it's been a it's been a while. Um, you've been wanting to go, is not it? Mm. Like how long? Like a few months, maybe. I mean, yeah. yeah, I don't know. I don't know a lot about Ipswich, but I mean, if it's a, uh, it could be the right decision. I mean, it could yeah, help Will's you. Yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. I mean, I've yeah. been. It's been with Mourinho. It's been I don't know. It's been a couple of months where I've been like, am I too sure of him? Is it is his football good for me to watch because it's really hurting my head at the moment. You know, but obviously that West Brom game hopefully has boosted the confidence. And um, I just wanted to ask if how good Troy Parrott's been because obviously I'm a Spurs fan has been really. No, I don't know. I, I no, yeah, no, it's, it's still early doors in the half. To be fair, mate. I don't it know, is. mate. You, you can keep games. saying that, but he's got to start doing let, something. Let, yeah, but let's just what he see. What, let's just what he see. Excuse my words. Let's see what he does under Paul Cook. Mm. Yeah. yeah, I suppose That'll you do say brilliant. that, though. Yeah, Millwall, mate, he was under a different manager, didn't yeah. perform for them, did he? Yeah. I mean, to be fair, the manager did say he's one of the best, like, he's got he's got good potential and he's one of the best finishers he's ever seen, apparently. Mm. He's in the upcoming next yeah. Harry Kane, and he or something, Spurs yeah. in his name. Yeah. Mm. That's Dane Scarlet, boy. Yeah, we got Dane Oh, yeah. he's, he's, yeah. I mean, he's only, he's played about 20 minutes for us, but he's so, I've seen, he's so good at getting in those positions to get the mm. goals. Like, yeah. he's been unlucky with a few of them, like, getting saved off target, but, yeah, he's looked really good, to be fair. Only Definitely. Now. Um, Archie, mate, we're going to get a few more people on. Thanks mm-hmm. for coming on, mate. Yeah, cheers well, for coming on, mate. Well, you, yeah, bro. Man. Okay. Oh, legend. Right. Um, we've got a Norwich fan waiting to come on. He's been on Is before. Is Shane, he's here. He's here. What's he got to say? How's it going? All right, mate. <laughs> not bad. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not really shocked by all the news, to be fair. I think it was long coming, wasn't it? Yeah, it was a matter of time ages ago if it weren't for all this flipping, you know all this going on at the moment but <laughs> hey we're there kind of do you, do you think it's all linked to the investors that are coming in or do you think it's just a sacking that was going to happen at any time I, think- I mean there was a disagreement wasn't there between the board and obviously Lambert and obviously his fellow you know lot as well his management team so it's obvious I think you know that that's got a lot to do with it because he did actually say 99.9% he would not be part of the club if yeah. the takeover obviously was going to happen. But also, mm. you know, that interview yesterday, as we all heard, boys, you know, it it was sort of the writing on the wall, really. It was almost like a resignation statement for me, saying, you know, bye-bye, I'm, I'm going to be going. And it's the, day, the, day, the days were numbered. And I think today, you know, we're seeing it now. You know, it's, I mean, we, we're not very aware that he's been paid all this money yet, but it's probably nah. already happened for all we know. But mutual consent, I mean, he's still going to be paid whatever the weather, surely, boys, isn't he? Mutual yeah, mutual consent so. nowadays is is an agreed dismissal. So he mm-hmm. it's not on his terms; it's the club as well, club. which therefore means yeah. you have to pay it, pay it out of his contract. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, I mean, if, I mean, if anyone heard his talk sport interview that he did like not so yeah. long ago, even yeah. going by that, I was thinking, yeah, he doesn't look like he's going to last that much longer. No, no, no. So. I think you know you're you're talking about the owner on on talk sport i mean i know his mates with um what's his name jim white but there you go i yeah, mean they were, they were trying to get him on weren't they but I think that's yeah they were they were they were trying yeah. to get evans on all, the, all that time so yeah, yeah. we'll have to see won't yeah. we what happens but can you, you... Can you as a, as... oh, oh no, carry on. no i was gonna say would you be happy with paul cook or do you think you need somebody else yeah no nah, paul cook's so, decent to be cook, fair yeah, yeah. I think nah, I think, I think he'd do a job definitely. Yeah. I think he I think he did well in the championship with Wigan. I think it was just <coughs> unfortunate they had that points deduction. Yeah. yeah. I think that's what ended them really. And that's still been there now. Yeah. To be fair, I think he might be building something pretty good there if it weren't for all that happening. But yeah. it could be the us now, boys. It could be the, the us fact, now. Who's the, the, the fact that Sheffield Wednesday even went in for him, it, I think it proves as well that he's going to be more than. He's a wanted now. man, isn't he? He's got he's got the experience, hasn't he? He can do it. Oh, yeah. so. And to turn down a few other clubs as well, just yeah. says it all. It does. Because yeah. he was on he was on um what was the game he was on Sky Sports? Um oh. like looking out for our game. Yeah. yeah. I can't remember which one that was, but yeah, I know. Oh, that was that was recently work like a yeah. I think it's yeah. the North, it's with Swindon. Swindon. Crew. That's Swindon, yeah, Swindon, yeah. Yes, that's it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. And Shane, he was as like, a, saying. As a Norwich fan, Shane, how how where do you see it just going from here? 
Um, Lambert's gone. I mean, I would say if you still had Lambert in, I'd say you probably wouldn't. I wouldn't say you'd go up this season, but you might be able to make a late push for the playoffs. I'd say. Yeah. What with yeah. What with our next manager? Well, I say if, if Paul if Paul Lambert was still in, I wouldn't expect him to get you up. I mean, I, I still wasn't expecting it anyway. I thought maybe you'll spend the third season in League One and see how you get on then. But with Paul Cook, you could make a late push for the playoffs. Boys, I mean, you're, you're, you're only eight, aren't you? Is it eight from the league? So. Yeah, yeah, we're two mm. points off six. Two points off playoffs. Um, yeah, so, so like, you're, yeah. you're not you're not a hundred miles away, are you? Am, so, I, am no. I being too optimistic, Shane, by saying top two's not out of it yet? Well, this is an unpredictable season, isn't it, for everyone? So you just never know, do you? Yeah. Boys, I've got some breaking news. Go on. Go on. Betton has been suspended on the Ipswich next manager. Really? It's no longer a market, yeah. Oh. What's that? Huh? So what's been Betting's suspended? Been the, the betting. Mate, I reckon... Yeah. You watch it get announced tonight. Yeah, that's Paul Cook all over them. Yeah, it's probably, yeah. Come, probably come the morning you'll be announced or something. Yeah, yeah. So here we are, manager come Fitman Tuesday then. By looks for them, <laughs> who knows? I reckon he'll watch the stands. I, I, yeah, yeah, I think I don't think he'll be at the game Tuesday. I think he'll no. he watch. Who's your next game? Watch he'll watch he it. Be. He could be. Yeah, we've got Acre and Stanley Shane. Uh, um, well, yeah, they're they're literally one place above us, so it's a must win, really. Yeah, you've got must to win, win that one. You've got to win that yeah. one. Yeah, but it, it's it's an unpredictable season. I mean, you, I mean, just look at the championship, even the Premier League season. It's just crazy, isn't it? So you it never is. know what can happen. Yeah, I think a lot of teams now are literally like neck and neck with each other now, pretty much, aren't they? You know, well, yeah. You, you never used to see that. You always see you always see like these big name clubs always at top of the league and everything. But now you know, you're seeing like teams like Barnsley, like yeah, I know, going for playoffs. I you think not, and yeah. Stanley also going for playoffs at the moment as well. You think. And Plymouth are goal in their first season in League One, so it's crazy, really, how teams are now suddenly, you know, competing with all these big name clubs, and hopefully we'll be able to go up ourselves. That'd be nice. I mean, Ipswich fans will hate this, but look what Mick McCarthy's done to Cardiff for fuck's sake. Well, yeah, he's yeah. not lost a game yet. He's not lost a game yet. So he's I mean, doing isn't well. he, what's he now? Is it? I can't remember what his record is now since he's you know, took over. People may people it's may crazy. hang back for me for everything I say here, but he is a fit and good manager for what he, he does. Is, you know? yeah. So. Yeah. I mean, if you give Mick McCarthy the money at Ipswich, you know, you, you don't know what well, you could have done. We, if we'd have given it to Mick McCarthy the money in January when we were top of the league, we'd, be, we'd still be in the Premier League now because we'd be our manager as well. I mean, I go back to the, the you know, the playoff semi-finals when we had you guys. You just mm. never know where that could have happened if we lost to you and you went to the final. Who knows what could have happened? Mm. You mean? Yeah. Yeah. I still, I always look at that day and think, what well, if that was Ipswich? You know, you just, you don't know. Yeah, yeah that's that's sending off football, isn't it? anything yeah. can happen. Well, what, and that's sending off did change it. What if Ferran yeah. didn't handball it? <coughs> it yeah, well, you just never It may have did. already got, it probably would have gone in though, wouldn't it? <laughs> yeah. Was it actually the first game? I mean, it was all to play for, it. wasn't it? I mean, it was 1 1 on the return leg, wasn't it? Or at Portman Road, it was 1 1, wasn't it? Mm. I think. Yeah. And then. Yeah. You, you're, you, you guys are in the game, aren't you, at Carrow Road? You never know what could have happened, but mm. that red yeah. card, I think, really turned you, really, didn't it? <laughs> done it. Just let the goal go in, play with 11 men still. Yeah, exactly. And while, while you're on here, mate, as well, we're going to say, like, uh, rest in peace to uh, uh, Glenn Roder, yeah, former manager, please. former West Ham, uh, Newcastle manager as well. Yeah. And, yeah. I, I mean, think you know what I do remember him because he was your manager when we when I first watched uh, our first derby when I was young. It was a, it was a three one win we had I think against you lot and we, I think Hainsey scored it twice that day. Yeah, and uh, yeah, that was that was one of my favourite derbies. That's what actually got me supporting Ipswich, believe it or not. You know, because I'd been to a few games with my dad and exactly yeah. now, you know. <laughs> so yeah, rest in peace to. To be Rose. fair, yeah, I mean, loads of Norwich fans posted like on on the Twitter page on the Norwich page, and they didn't know how to take the news because they didn't obviously like him as a manager, but obviously because mm. he passed away, you know, it's a bit mixed, you know. Yeah, so, yeah, but yeah, nah. I think, yeah. But yeah, hopefully this is the turning point now for you guys, isn't it? Think, no, yeah, yeah. We, think we need some luck. We need something to happen for our football club because I think most of us, apart from probably maybe Smithy, have not seen success really, have we? <laughs> yeah. I've seen have quite a few good success, but yeah, this is the worst it's ever been. Yeah, hundred percent. So we need to get get ready for hopefully. I suppose, uh, I suppose your high ambitions, because obviously, let's be fair, the last decade or so hasn't been great, has it? <laughs> No, no, I, I agree. I mean, so you know, I'm guessing your high expectations in the next decade, you want to be playing Premier League football, I'm going to assume. Ten years of time? 
Well, you never know. Take over. <laughs> if not before, mate. Yeah, well, if not before, then yeah, of course. I mean, if these new investors come in, you know, give Paul Cook a bit of money to play with and see what happens, really. Yeah. So, yeah. as we all know, like Norwich are in a problem in the Championship. They're going to go to the Premier League. Do you see yourself as Norwich going to come straight back down? See, this is how I look at it now. I mean, most most will laugh and go, oh, you didn't give it a good crack. Well, there, there was a couple of reasons why we didn't give it a good go. But we, sort of, we invested in the training ground, which is pretty decent now. Because to be fair, in the past, we had freaking poor cabins left, right and centre. Mm. It, was, it was not a great place to come. And most players, I mean, believe it or not, Norwich were linked... Oh, who were they linked with? It wasn't. I don't think it was Fergal. I think it was Toby Alderwick, Alder, Alder, yeah, whatever his freaking name yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alder Byrold, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, him. Yeah, him. Yeah. He was linked to the club, and the reason why he didn't want to come because the facilities wasn't very good. So who knows what could have happened? But um, yeah. I think if we're gonna, this is the this will be the time to give it a good crack now because Weber's contract runs out. I think it's either one, one to two years time, so his his time's running out. And he's already admitted he wants to go to like a Champions League club or whatever. So mm. if we're going to do it, it's got to be next season, really. Yeah. And if it doesn't happen, then yeah, we'll just go straight back down again. But hopefully mm. we'll give it a good crack. I think it depends if our main players stay, really. Like your Buendias, your Aarons, your top Chad and Wells. Mm. I can't see Roger can hold on a lot of them. No. Yeah. I mean... I mean, I listen to Emmy's interviews when he like gets man of the match and stuff. He always gets questioned about it, and I'm like, I think going by his interviews, like he wants to get the club up, and then I think once he gets the club up, he probably want to leave. Yeah, he'll go. Yeah. I feel as I feel as though as well. Like if you boy, obviously you boys would go up, and like say if you have a poor start to the season, and then come January, you're not doing yeah, that. Yeah, he'll, he'll, he'll be gone. He'll be gone. Same with same with Camo as well. All the main stars will be gone. If yeah, because it's like the championship season. If we weren't in the top six. Most of our stars have been gone in January for sure. I never already talked with Max Aaron's going already to Everton. Uh, yeah. yeah, and to be fair, I would not be surprised come the summer he's gone yeah. to Everton. I That'd be another surprised. player which you've lost to Everton as well, wouldn't it? Because you sort of lost, yeah, because yeah. obviously got Godfrey's Godfrey, gone to yeah. Everton, hasn't he? So it would make sense for him to link up with his mate, I guess. So, mm. not only that, you're forgetting about the fact your best player this season in um, Oliver Skip's not going to be there for you, either. yeah, again, yeah. yeah. Most Norwich fans are worried about that because he's been probably one of our most consistent young players in the There's championship. There's at least four or five players there you could lose come January if you're not doing that great. Exactly. So it's <laughs> it's going to be quite an interesting season, really, if we do get promoted. What's going to happen? I mean, it's going to be the same with you guys if you can make a quick push for promotion this season. So mm. yeah, yeah. yeah and, then it's gonna, um, and then up and then it'll be yeah. interesting if you do get yourself up. What happens in the championship? I guess. Yeah, yeah. 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 will be. Because I guess you wouldn't yeah. want to spend another 15 plus years in the same league. Nope. I had to bring that up. <laughs> I know. Same. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, anyway, yeah, okay. Shane, thanks for coming on, mate. We're going to yeah, get another right. person. Yeah, cheers, mate. Yeah, Take care, guys. Take care. Yeah. Right, boys, I need a drum roll for this. Are you ready? Not Swanee, is it? Oh, oh. Swanee! <laughs> <laughs> Out the boys, we're having a party. Yes, yeah, Swally. Consecutive Swally promotions. You, I've called it here first. <laughs> the boys, what fantastic news that is on me Sunday evening. Oh, I, know. I can't, mate, I can't believe it. So, so it was announced so late as well on a Sunday evening. Yeah. I don't know. Oh, yeah. mental. My phone was they had... spamming. I thought, what's going on here? Has something happened? <laughs> yeah, they had to um they had to finish their roast oh. dinners. That's what that was about. <laughs> what, was your, what was your initial reaction, Swan? Go on, on. I want a replay of your reaction. Oh, my reaction. Well yeah, um look my mate Lewis put it in the um put it in the group chat for us. I didn't believe him, so I've head I've head over to Twitter. It's like been up there for like 11 minutes and it already had like 2k likes or something. It, it was going mental. I wonder how many Crazy. likes he's got. Should we have a look? I was, I, mate, I was shocked. I was shocked that I thought I if we'd done it at any point, right it would have been after the um crew game or something. Not after we picked up two wins in a row, but... Mm. The thing is, I think the players knew, though. <laughs> what knew he was done? Yeah. 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 yeah, probably. I reckon. I reckon they would. That he's obviously been told something behind the um yeah. behind the scenes. I reckon they all have. Because I just think I find it a bit. I find it a bit strange if it was like just a bit of a. If the decision was only now made, I, I don't know why they'd have made it now instead of a few games ago. Yeah. 
It was yeah, true. Yeah. So, like, your... thought, so. Go on, go ahead. No, I, I, go on. I was going to say, like one of your quiz questions last night, Caleb, our town going up. Yes, they are. <laughs> yes, they are. We're going up this season, and then it's HMS Piss the League next season as well. Oh, we're, going God. To, we're going up to the Prem, and we're getting we're getting Europe football in the first season there. Champions and then League. Champions League. <laughs> <laughs> no, I didn't. I didn't, <laughs> didn't, I didn't want to be too uh, too unrealistic, mate. Yeah, <laughs> no, mate, imagine, news, imagine man. this, right? Imagine if we get promoted to the Premier League, and it's a Norwich Ipswich in the Premier. Oh, no. oh, I'm being too that's optimistic. Been for ages, man. I'm being too optimistic. No, because what will happen is when we, because Norwich are going up this season and we're going up, we're guaranteed to go up next season as well. But Norwich are guaranteed to go down because they're just a yo-yo club, aren't they? <laughs> and then we'll be, oh. then we'll absolutely shred them. Yeah, mate, it's gonna be. There we go. If, if Ben be... suspended, does this mean that they, um, Sky Sports know that Paul Cook's coming in, or someone else, or I don't know? Someone else, yeah. Well, they know someone has been confirmed. Yeah. yeah. Mm, you reckon? Yeah, yeah easy. Pep Guardiola. Yeah. Heard it as well. <laughs> Real Madrid is coming to Palmer Road. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it just, bring, <laughs> just brings the City squad over. I'll tell you what, if we had the City squad and Paul Lambert was manager, I still don't reckon he'd play any of them. <laughs> <laughs> Probably not. He'd bring them on 87th minute impulse, impact sub. He'd rather start Chambers <laughs> over fucking Kyle Walker. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yes, you would. Now that That's is funny. brilliant news. To be uh, fair, though. But yeah, Swanee. Anyway, I know you're you're working tomorrow, aren't you? So I'll let you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah I got work tomorrow. Um, I thought I'd pop on, say hello, cheers for having me on, and uh, Swanee. Um, how, how, Swanee, how you feel about another quiz next week? Next What's Saturday? the day next week? Um, yeah, yeah, I'd, I'd be on that. If, if you're doing it, I'll be on it. Yeah, right, decent, bro. Nice Love one. Man. Cool, cool, cool. I'll let you both talk. Thank you, Sue, man. See you later. There you go. Uh, right, what, what do you reckon, lads? Should we go till, should we go till an hour? Like another few minutes? Or do you want to keep depends going? If anyone, depends if anyone, anyone, anyone else gets them all in if they, if they want to still be in, mate. There's loads there's of people. No one, no, one, no one backstage at the moment, but I'll whack the link in again. There's 200 of you in here. I'm hmm. sure there's more people that can come on. So look, don't be afraid. Click that link and get in the stream. Let's get you involved. Um... For a chat, basically. Anyway, I mean, if no one comes in, they'll just wrap it up because we're yeah. just sitting there and mm. saying the same thing constantly. So, yeah. I've got a question: Do we reckon Paul Lambert will get another job? Ooh. Do we reckon he will? I think he'll get Celtic. Nah, that no, 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 no. I don't know, mate. It's I not, don't know. He's not proven uh, enough here. No, 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 he's no. not proven no. enough here. They're already in shit, mate. They don't need to be in anymore. <laughs> <laughs> not happening. Not happening. Well, um, anyway, let's whack the link in again. We're gonna whack it in. There's no one joining. In. There's no one, no one in yet. No. I think I was just too um, surprised and speechless. I think more than anything. Mm. Are we? But yeah. Um, look, if you are new to the channel, please subscribe. As we are, you know, there's 210 people here. So people, there should be someone who wants to come on. Really. Um, Someone's put Alex. Why don't you? Why don't you guys now go and talk about League One in just in general, and do like a weekend review? All right, yeah, we could do. Could yeah, do yeah. Town are fucking going up. <laughs> <laughs> review finish. Wait, Harvey. Harvey. Ooh. Harvey is that buzzing? Look, he's sitting on his stairs to celebrate. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come oh, on. So, boys, um, I might as well say this now. Then, how are we feeling for Accrington away? Stanley, mate, Tuesday. I, I still feel confident. I said that, didn't yeah. I? After after the weekend, I, I say we'll go and win there, mate. Yeah. yeah. If we win there, weekend. if we win there, then anything's possible from here on, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. As a, there's a, there's a fan up there, mate. I think what's the joy? Right in the, right in the mixer there. Mm, yeah. yeah. Uh, right. Um, come on, people. Click the link. We've got someone waiting backstage. Let's get him in. Hello, oh, mate. Hello, mate. Hello. Uh, how are you? We're good. We Very are good, yeah. How what are team you? do you support? Uh, I support Bristol City, but I've been following oh. Twitch for uh, quite Bristol a long City. time now, actually. Yeah. Really? All oh, right. What What do you make What do you make of Nigel Pearson, mate? New manager. Mm, good manager, uh, but he needs time uh, to adapt to his system. 
Um, good couple of results, but need some more time at the moment. Yeah. And what do you make of the whole Lambert situation at Ipswich? Obviously, tonight, it got on, you know, you, you obviously know it. Yeah. yeah. Um, bit of a mess in the end, but uh, he had to go, but it's just can he you, didn't can... have to. Yeah. It didn't have to lead up to this situation. It, um, he should have been sacked much earlier, in my opinion. Yeah. Very true. We all want him out earlier, and unfortunately, that never got done early enough. But it's done now, so we could yeah. be on the up possibly after here. But we'll have to see, won't we? It's so been, I saw, been, I saw you guys been, win. Go on, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Lost, yeah, sorry. Go on, sorry, sorry, sorry. Now, I was gonna say you guys won at the weekend, didn't you? Three one at uh, Swansea, didn't you? Yeah. I mean, Did you yeah, make the win? It was, it was. It was a bit of a fluke result because we were utterly outplayed. We were utterly dreadful in the first half. That's Pearson for you, mate. He, he's a shit-house yes. manager. Mm. He'll, he'll get the team playing, you see. He'll get the team playing. That's what, that's what he's all about. He done, he done it with Leicester. He brought them up. He kept them up for that season. And look what happened to them the other season after that. They got Premier League. Mm. He, so. he definitely builds up foundations, but it's just that we need them for long term because we can't keep them for short term at the moment because we just can't afford yeah. that. Um, yeah, we, we've yeah. already had too many short-term managers, so we need them for long-term. Yeah. Do you miss Lee Johnson that much? No. <laughs> I mean... No? Um, <laughs> no, not at all. I, I'd, like no. Him, I'd like him to do well um, at some point, but yeah. just, he, he just lost his uh, magic touch in the end because he, mm, yeah. he used to motivate players very well, but he just lost it. Yeah, because you were there or thereabouts when you cut the seasons in a row. I think you did pretty well in some of the FA Cup um, seasons you had. You were beating Man United and quite a few other teams. And you were nearly there or thereabouts with getting into playoffs. So, crazy, yeah, really. We, 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 finished, we, finished, we, we finished eight in, uh, eighth in 17, uh, 17, 18. We beat Man, in, uh, Man United and uh, pushed Man City really close. That's it. When, yeah, uh, when, they, when, when they finished on 100 points. So... Um, yeah, it's, it, it was really good then, but it just went down from there. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's crazy how time flies, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, we... Yep. It was just a bit of a mess in the end at uh, Bush City as well. But yeah, Ipswich yeah. as well, it's just a really... It's just a mess at both clubs and really depressing to support. What, what do you... I'll pose this question to you now, actually, while we're on the topic. What do you, what do you make of your owner, uh, Ashton? Uh, no, he's our he's the our CEO. sporting CEO. director. Sorry, CEO, sorry, that's it. Sorry, he's, that's our, what I meant. he's our sporting director. Um, he just yeah. takes control of everything. He shouldn't really, but he just does. Uh, just, just, yeah. it's just really frustrating because he's all he, he always gives managers head coach head coach when when he when they're supposed to work out the tactics. But it almost feels like he's he's the one at training grounds constantly. Oh, yeah. And, yeah, like yeah. it's just just it's just that's why I don't uh, want. But that's why I kind of want to leave, but I don't want Ipswich fans to go through the same thing because it's just going to be, it's just, yeah. it's just going to be, it's just going to be yeah. dictatorship because that's what he does. And um, John Lansdowne, who's the son of Steve Lansdowne, who's the owner of the club, he, he has no power as well. I mean, the, it's just Mark Ashton says he wants the player. Steve Lansdowne believes him and is like, fine, I'll give you the money. We paid, we paid 16 million for a player in the second division of France and he's been utterly hopeless. He's played about who's one game the season. Hanno Masengo, he's, he's been utterly hopeless. Mm. We've paid 16 million for him and it's just not worked out. What about, what about happened to Eliasson? What about happened to Eliasson? I swear he was meant to be the next big, big thing there, weren't he? He, he moved to um, France in the summer yeah. this this summer um, for like 2 million. We bought him for 3 million. And yeah. uh, he's such a good player and we miss him so badly because we've got so many problems down uh, down the left hand side with our players being injured as well so yeah, yeah it's just a bit of a massive moment mm. yeah do you think we'll get you know playoffs or go up via you know promotion not what do you think season. not this season definitely not I mean we're we're close we're seven I think we're seven points off player sorry um but card for the role and under McCarthy um, form mm. for taking more points now. It's, it's just going to be hard catching up with teams in form above us. Uh, well, it's going to be really hard, yeah. but hopefully, hopefully we can. What about us? What about Ipswich? Where do you think we'll finish? Two points off the playoffs. Um, if you can hire a good manager um, in the next few weeks and get a few results and get some momentum going, I think you can finish. I think you can push. But it's just going to be the gap between. It's just going to be the amount of teams that are between you and the players. 
um, is gonna is, is gonna depend. Um, you, you can certainly close the gap. It's just it's just the amount, amount of teams um, in between you and the playoffs. Yeah, yeah, definitely. it's very close up there. Yeah. Um, mate. Anyway, thank you for coming on. Appreciate it. And um, have yeah, a great. Evening. Yeah. Take care, mate. All the best. See you later, mate. Oh, you look at your phone. Right. Um, cool. Hmm, I just okay, see. a few more people backstage. We've got. <laughs> I've got the cameraman backstage. Oh. Connor. Alex, how are you doing, son? You're right, mate. Yeah, we're good, mate. How are you? Can you hear me? Yeah. <laughs> Connor. <laughs> <laughs> okay guys so for the for the, uh, the, the for those who don't know um alex has a bit of a fetish with me for... <laughs> see you i'm not letting him mug me off he's trying, he's trying, he's trying, to, he's trying to mug me off on my stream i'm done connor you trying to mug mate, me off mate mate it's the prank calls yeah, the prank calls. That, you're trying to get me back they are quite funny same. They're laying in there. No, mate, honestly, mate, the last three years, but, um, this is not about that and Alex's strange fetishes. This is about Lambert being out. And finally, um, it, it, as the last lad said, it's been long coming. And thank God he's now out. Like, we can actually... I, fair enough, you know, he's two wins on the trot. He's going... Mm, all right, mate, mate. It's better than going out on a double loss. Uh, but makes him look, look a bit better, maybe, but... You know how it is. So, um, mm. you know, fair play to him. He, I mean, There's not really much fair play on second thoughts, is there? But, yeah. yeah. Um, he wasn't the man for the job at the end of the day. Yeah. And, um, yeah, if that wasn't evident at Norwich last season. Or was it mm. last season? Whatever it was. Um, yeah. yeah. And then, I don't know. I don't know when it was. <laughs> uh, thank God he's out. Um, yeah. You know. We've got um, who's on Nigel Pearson, isn't it? Yeah, no, he's, been... he's got Bristol. He's Bristol. All right, who who who's our replacement manager? Paul Cook. I haven't... Paul, Paul Cook. Cook. Paul Cook. Paul Paul Cook. Cook. Yeah. All right. What's this? Uh, yeah. I haven't really I haven't really spoken to you recently, Alex. So um, I'm going to ask you a question as well. What's um, what's your views on this US consortium taking over? What what do you think? So uh, what 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 do you think it's going to bring? And that can go for everyone, Coxie, Smithy, and yeah, yeah no, I think we all we all we all want it to happen. We all want to sort yeah. of see, you know, fresh things at the club because it's not worked under Evans the past mm. 13, 14 years. So yeah. I think you know I've heard good things about Brett Johnson, who is who'd be the owner. Uh, yeah. So yeah, no, I want it to happen, and I think it's going to happen because Lambert wouldn't have been sacked tonight if there wasn't something going on with this takeover. Mm. So I think it will happen. Yeah. Um, Sky Sports News as well. They've even said it's going to be happening in the next. Did Coxie just say the next few days? I think. Few days or next week. Yeah, which is. Yeah. I'm gonna head off. Um, that's yeah, alright, mate. Jason, I need Jason's, to Jason's. Yeah, Jason's off. Okay, that's cool. Um, but Connor, mm -hmm. are you one word to describe how you're feeling right now? Go on. Ecstatic. I think we all feel like, mate, at the moment. I think we're. I think, all I think I'm, I'm pretty this. pretty delighted about it. You know, finally he's mm. got his. He's got his marching yeah. orders. Finally, so let's um let's see where mm. we can pick it up. Can we? Yeah, we are on the brink of playoff, so if you know if mm. um Cook can um yeah. swipe in at the last minute now and get us to these playoffs and get us back into the championship. You know yeah. we, if we do get into the championship, I think it is looking a bit into the ahead though. Um <clears throat> we've got to be so this Brett Johnson, is that his name, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Um I've seen he he's a businessman at the end of the day. Um He's investing seventy four and a half, was it seventy five and a half million, something like that. Um, yeah. I think when he get, if we come up this season, championship, are we a Premier League side? No, no, I don't think we are. Um, maybe back in the day, but I think if we could get top six championship next season, bring some new legs in, new money, I think he'll sell up. Where does that leave us? That I think I don't know if we're digging a, uh, if we're digging ourselves a bigger hole to be honest, but um, but yeah, it's um, it's an interesting one, yeah. and obviously the questions are still there, and um, I can't wait to be filming back with you, mate, and all. It's been it's yeah. been too long. Yeah, it's been too long. Yeah, it's gonna be good, man. It's gonna be good. Um, mm. cannot wait. Mate, if we get if we get if we get the playoff, then we will be back at Portman Road, mate. Yeah. we'll be at Wembley. <laughs> Wembley. Hopefully, let's have, let's have Wembley. Win. Come on. 
if we can win the semi finals of that, that'd be a good start, wouldn't it? <laughs> Oof, 100%. Yeah. 100%. Hopefully. That would be the charity. Anyway, on the Connor, mm -hmm. we're going to get one more person in after you. Thanks for coming on, mate. Cheers, no problem, man. Uh, cheers, cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Uh, in a bit, Coxie. See you later. Yeah, have a good one, Alex. Uh, enjoy Thanks, the stream. Mate. Have a good one, mate. In a bit. Cheers, yeah. mate. Uh, right, we've got uh, Paul, uh, Paul McAllister. Right, I'm going to get him out for a minute because he's got a... Mate, if you if you want to come on, turn the stream off so we can't hear it in the background. Right, we've got Dan McAllister. Dan, sorry, Dan Perkins here. Dan Perkins, how you doing? All right. <laughs> can't hear him. You all right? Can't, can't hear you. Yeah. Well, he's trying to get his volume him. sorted. We can't hear him. We'll, we'll get him out. Oh, just just try and work your audio. <laughs> Maybe check your check your camera and mic. Your camera's on, but your mic as well. You might want to check that. Probably your mic, um, mate. Yeah. 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 Uh, whilst he's sorting that out. Oh, he's gone. Right. Whilst um, he he might be back. We'll leave it a minute. We'll end. The, we might end the stream soon though, because uh, we've covered everything. We've given you our reaction, and I have got a video as well to go up. Coxie, when should I upload the video? Should I do it tonight? Try and smash yeah, it tonight. Yeah, as soon as possible, mate. As soon as possible, yeah. Because um, it's still pretty oh. fresh news. It was only over an hour ago. Rift, mate, I think I think you should go and get it done now, mate. Get chop chop on. Yeah, yeah. I'll probably end it here then. Um, anyway, boys and girls, we've given you our live reaction. We've got in plenty of other people to give their reactions and what they make of it. And I thought, well, I actually really enjoyed this stream, boys. I really enjoyed it. Yeah, I have as well. It's been probably one of the more celebrational ones isn't it <laughs> yeah it was definitely a good thing that we did this stream um but look i'm gonna go and get a video ready to upload now i'm gonna try and get it up for about half 11 that's a bit mm. ambitious half 11 and um or 12 mid i might go for a midnight upload if anyone's awake at midnight make sure you watch it um <laughs> but coxie and Ronda, have you got any more words mate before i finish it here no. I mean, I'm I'm like you boys. I'm speechless. But yeah, like I say, up the town. That's just the best news we need to go forward with, and let's yeah. hope we can use this and go up. Yeah, so, yeah. and ev everyone can expect to see you Tuesday night as well on the Accrington. Of course, of course, yeah. Yeah. like always. Cool. All right, legends. I'm gonna get you out, yeah, Mondo. Thanks for coming on, Coxie. Coming in on. a bit, boys. I'll speak to you both right. in a little while. Right, I'm gonna end it here. 163 of you legends are still sat here watching me on your screens and i do appreciate it what a night it has been i'm still in shock i'm still it's still sinking in okay but if you've joined this stream today and you haven't smashed that thumbs up button please go and smash it right now we're nearly at 200 likes if we can hit 200 likes before i end this stream in about 20 seconds smash that thumbs up button okay please do press that red subscribe button as well as we are on the road to 14,000 subscribers and um, I've in, I have really, really enjoyed tonight's stream. You know, brilliant news tonight. You know, at the end of the day, we can't. You know, we it's, it's a good. It's, we're all happy, and um, we've still got to. You know, as much as we probably don't want to, but we've still got to wish Lambert the best for his future. Whatever he goes and does, um, you know, it's just the right thing to do, isn't it? But I'm happy he's gone because he's not the right man for Ipswich, and I'm sure Mr. Paul Cook will be coming in. In the next few days. It's going to get announced. I know it. I can already smell it. Paul Cook is coming to Ipswich Town, boys and girls. So, fasten up your seatbelts. Because this is going to be a hell of a ride. The last 15, 15, 16 games of the season we've got left. Is going to be a big roller coaster. I hope we can get into the playoffs. I hope we can beat Accrington Stanley on Tuesday. I will be live on this YouTube channel on Tuesday night for Accrington Stanley. And I want to see... A record number of people, okay? I think the record we've had in an Ipswich Town stream is about 500 people. So, Tuesday, this is how it's going to go. This is how we're going to work on Tuesday, okay? I want every single one of you that joins the stream to bring along with you one friend, okay? And then already, we will have doubled the amount of people watching that stream, okay? We've got loads to cover. We're going to talk more in depth about Paul Lambert's departure, Okay, we're going to talk, potentially, if Paul Cook's announced tomorrow, we might delve into Paul Cook, or the potential new manager. Okay, we're going to get guests on, we're going to get predictions, it's going to be a really fun show, and um, we've got a few games to do as well. So, Tuesday evening, Ipswich Town are away against Accrington Stanley, 7pm kickoff. I'm going to be live from 6.30pm, or quarter past six, I haven't decided yet, but keep your eyes peeled, alright? If you turn on the bell notification down below, you'll be notified every single time I upload a video 
and go live on YouTube to do a stream, all right? I'm going to edit a video now. I'm going to upload it as soon as I can. I know I've done this live stream as well, but I thought I'd treat you all, you know, a little bonus for you all. So, yeah, be expecting a video in the next 45 minutes because I'm going to try and edit it now and upload it. It was literally my initial reaction. I, as soon as I read the tweet, I got my camera and filmed my reaction. It's brilliant. Um, but, yeah, thank you for all joining this live stream. I've given you my live reaction. All the boys have been here as well, so shout out to all the boys. And uh, to everyone that did come on the stream tonight, big up to yourselves. I appreciate you all coming on. Um, but yeah, last of all, smash that thumbs up button. Smash the red subscribe button. Ramondo, he's still here. He's buzzing with his... Come button. on. He, he, he loves it. He loves it. Um, right, I'm going to end it here. Thanks for watching, everyone. And I'll see you very soon. But as well, one more thing before I do end it. Go and check out my latest fitness video. Um, go and smash that like for me. It's not done brilliant. But keep your eyes peeled for this Paul Lambert reaction video I'm going to upload very soon. Right. See you all later. Uh, what a live stream. What a night. Lambert's gone.